Welcome everybody. So we have the pleasure today to invite Mr. Abdallah Ram Singh, who's a passionate developer who likes to share a lot of his knowledge in our current channel today uh, to explain a bit how within the IT environment or the IT world, you as a developer, you can differentiate yourself. So Mr. Abdallah, just a very quick uh, overview about him. He has a decade of experience within the IT world, someone who has always been there uh, to support anybody, uh, as far as I know, and has been contributing to the community via multiple videos, uh, also code session on Git, uh, and has been putting a lot of emphasis into, I would say, marketing. So I would leave it to Mr. Abdallah. So today's session, you guys, just to have an introduction about how to differentiate yourself within this environment of IT as a developer. Cool. So Abdallah, over to you. OK, thank you, Idaria. Hello, everyone. Today, I'm going to share three solid tips on how to differentiate yourself as an IT professional in the Mauritian market. So nowadays, more than ever, there's a huge amount of competition. Normally, most of us will be working in either ERP, CRM systems, web development using a limited set of languages, or mostly database systems. We don't really venture into the world of AI, machine learning, data science, blockchain, but also some really high paying languages such as Ruby, Go, Elixir, and Scala. Since we are in a small and similar pool finally, we need to ask, how do we differentiate ourselves? So tip number one, certifications. Look for a niche that interests you and do certifications in it. For example, PMP or AWS Certified Solutions Architect. Now, why some jobs require certifications? It's a way to filter out candidates and show that you're serious about the technology, but also demonstrates that you are willing to invest in yourself. Tip number two, personal branding. What if you are incredibly good in your field, but no one knows about it? Or you want to build a personal brand that will help you get noticed to begin with in your own company, with your own colleagues. In my opinion, the best way to get started is to write about your knowledge consistently and share it on social media. Finally, the best tip for the last, networking in your free time. Join meetups and conferences. By doing so, you will meet like-minded people and exchange with them. I find this drastically skyrockets my motivation when doing so. But otherwise, it will curve opportunities that most professionals don't have. A quick stat. 70% of jobs are never published online through job portals, but can only be found through referrals and or networking. That's it for today. If you have any question, feel free to ask me on social media. See you next time. Okay, thanks. Thanks a lot, Abdallah. So just to conclude here, guys, you've seen Mr. Abdallah, so feel free to post anything, any queries on our channel or any question you can have. Thanks.